All right, eighth graders, this is to help you with the first question on your fourth CR. It says, what power of 10 should replace N to make the statement 34,900,000 is equal to 3.49 times N true? Okay, first thing I like to do with problems like this is I like to use estimation. So I say to myself, okay, this is really about 34 million. This is really about three. So three times what number would get me to, even if I didn't go 34 million, even if I said 30 million, I, if I estimate it just makes it so I don't have to deal with all these extra numbers. So three times what gets me 30 million? Well, I wonder if three times 10 would get me 30 million. Let's see. 3 times 10. Oh no, that's only 30. Okay, great. I wonder if 3 times 100,000 would get me to 30 million. So then I try 3 times 100,000. Ooh, that gets me to 300,000. <laughs> hmm. I wonder if 3 times 1 million would get me to 30 million. Well, guess what 3 times 1 million is? Oh, that's right. It's 3 million. I wonder if 3 times 10 million would get me to 30 million. So 3 times 10 million. Well, I keep doing every time when you're multiplying um, a number by some power of 10. It's just 3 times 1 is 3 and how many zeros after? 3 times 1 is 3 and then I keep the same number of zeros. 3 times 1 is 3, I keep the same number of zeros. So here I'm just going to use that same thing. Because guess what 3 times 10 million is? 3 times 1 is 3, and then I just keep 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 zeros. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7 zeros. Boop, boop. 3 times 10 million will get you up to 30 million. So I know it's D, and I simply used estimation to get me there, just to make my numbers a little bit easier. Could you have kept this number? Yup, 3.49 times 10 million will get you 34,900,000. I hope that helps.